يكون وانتم اللي باصوا لهم رب شيلي صدري وين سلي امري واهل الاقدة من لسان يفكى وكوني اي ويلكم اول اوف يو وذ اسلامي جريتنجز السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله وبركاته May peace, and blessings of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be your own. I welcome you to the special program of Better Half or Bitter Half. And in this program, you're most welcome to ask any questions related to marriage, how to conduct a nikah, regarding how married life should be led. You can ask any questions that you'd like to know before you say, I do, before you say, Kabule, before you say, I accept it. Or any questions related to anything that related to your life after you say I do, after you say Kabule, after you say I accept it. Most welcome to ask any questions regarding marriage. In short, you're most welcome to ask any questions so that after you say I do, you should have a successful wedlock and not a padlock. So the program will start better half or better half, wedlock or padlock. Any other sister has any questions? Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Is it encouraged to marry within the same community like Kokneys marry only Kokneys? This has a question that is it encouraged for a girl or a boy to marry within the same community like Kokney marrying Kokney or Mehman marrying Mehman? We only got stuck to Kokney because I'm a Kokney. So it can go Sheikh marrying a Sheikh or a Sayyid marrying a Sayyid. Who realize the beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said it's preferable to marry the same type of people, same category, whether it may be in category in terms of ethnicity, whether it may be in terms of economic status, whether it be in terms of community, because the compatibility is there, because the Kokani have a different style of living, the Mehman have a different style of living, the Keralite may have a different style of living, the person, UK American person, a different style of living, the European may have, so it's easy to gel. So it is preferable, but not a fard. Similarly, imagine an African marrying a European. It can go well, not it's not possible. It's possible, but the chances of compatibility is less. Similarly, a Chinese coming and marrying someone from Kerala, not that it's not possible, it's possible, but if you want to break this barrier for a cause, for example, I'm finding a more virtuous non kokni then I prefer marrying a non kokni than marrying a kokni for in my case I could not leave us at kokni I could not get a girl from Bombay who I wanted to purchase so I had to go to Pune I had to travel 160 miles so I not only left the community I left the city also so your reason to marry was virtue so if virtue is the criteria, if you break these barriers of economic status, of nobility, of community, of ethnicity, there's no problem. Otherwise, generally, if exactly same, same virtues, who is from your community, not from your community, preferable, same virtues from your community. Same virtues who is rich and who is poor, and if you are rich, then same virtues who is rich is preferable. But if you find that one person more virtuous and out of the community is preferable, that one person is more important than matching your community or matching your ethnicity or matching your economic status. But if the virtue is not the criteria, otherwise marrying in the same level is preferable so that life becomes easier. So when you have a choice to choose the easy part, it's preferable to choose the easy part than the difficult.